Hi, my name is Pete Martin, and I'm with the Helen Wells Agency. Mr. Bradley Fries? Oh, Fries, just like ice. Uh, you can call me Brad, and uh, you must be my famous cousin Christian. Yes, yes, here I am. Well, how about that big famous writer and all? And this is Robin Kepler. She's taking photographs for the article. Oh, yeah, Robin, hi. Uh, you know something here? Can we hold off on the whole picture-taking thing for right now? You know, just uh, just give us a minute to get to know each other here. We're not used to this sort of thing. I get it. Well, come on in, then. So, if you don't mind, uh, please explain to us what exactly is bringing you here to America. I know you're working on something for the New York Times, but I didn't quite catch the whole approach over the phone. The assignment is vague, but very interesting. I have a new book, and in connection with that, they asked me to turn my gaze upon America. Scandinavia, America, reflections about the old world and the new. Of course, what it means to be Danish in America, from the Vikings down to the farmer immigrants, down to you and me. So then, I think just to be clear here, you know, we're happy to have you in our home and to get to know each other, but we just assume not be a part of your article. I mean, when you got in touch with us, we assumed it was more to see us kind of on the side, you know, more of a personal thing just for yourself. Oh no, this is crucial part of my piece. To meet a version of myself had I been born in America. Oh, you bet. Uh, very interesting. You know, matter of fact, we've often talked about visiting Denmark someday too. Kind of a dream of ours. The closest we ever got was England. But, all the same. Okay, yes. I understand. You're right. Let's not worry about the article for now. Let's just get to know each other, as you say, as family. 